In this video I am telling you amazing facts about Russia. As the world's largest country, Russia occupies one-tenth of all the land on Earth. It spans 11 time zones across two continents Europe and Asia and has shores on three oceans the Atlantic, Pacific, and Arctic Oceans. The Russian landscape varies from sandy and frozen deserts, and tall mountains to giant marshes. Much of Russia is made up of rolling, treeless plains called steppes. The region of Siberia, which occupies three quarters of Russia, is dominated by sprawling pine forests called taigas. The Russian landscape varies from desert to frozen coastline, tall mountains to giant marshes. Russia has around 100,000 rivers, including some of the longest and most powerful in the world. It also has many lakes, including Ladoga and Wanka, and Lake Baikal, which contain more water than any other lake on Earth. The world's longest railway is in Russia. The Trans-Siberian Railway extends from Moscow to Vladivostok, a total of 5,772 miles. If you want to take your time and travel around Russia by train, the Trans-Siberian Railway makes it easy to do so. The Trans-Siberian Railway even connects to China and Mongolia if you have the desire to visit those countries as well. Read more, Mongolia pictures from the Russian border to the Gobi Desert. It's the famous Trans-Siberian Railway. At 9,288 kilometers long, it's more than twice the length of the second longest Toronto to Vancouver in Canada. Russia has 12 active volcanoes. Another one of the most surprising facts about Russia is that it has 12 active volcanoes. Of those volcanoes, Kamchatka is one of the most commonly visited due to its accessible location. This active volcano has over 1,000 different species of plants. It's also home to brown bears, sheep, and wolves. The first human into space was Russian. The famous cosmonaut Yuri Gagarin journeyed into outer space in 1961. If you don't know the difference between an astronaut and a cosmonaut, wonder no more. A cosmonaut is trained by the Russian Space Agency, while an astronaut is trained by NASA, the European Space Agency, the Canadian Space Agency, or the Japanese Aerospace Exploration Agency. Siberia makes up a majority of the land. Siberia makes up 77% of the Russian Federation. Siberia is a large region in northern Russia. While it makes up 77% of the land, only 20% of the Russian people live in Siberia due to the harsh conditions. Siberia reminded us a lot of Canada. And the people were so friendly and welcoming. If you love to get off the beaten path while traveling, you should visit Siberia.
Russia has a lot of trees. One fifth of the world's trees are in Russia. That's 643 billion trees, the most that any country has. About 45% of the country is covered by trees, much of it in Russia's boreal forest, or taiga. These thick forest regions were once completely under glaciers and are now home to a whole load of brave species, including the Siberian tiger, wild boars, eagles, and owls. Unfortunately, these forests face threats from deforestation and forest fires, so organizations like the WWF and Greenpeace are doing their best to protect them. Russia is the largest country by land mass. Russia is the largest country in the world. That is excellent for travelers because that means there is plenty to explore. The total land mass of Russia is 6,601,665 square miles. That is equal to 11% of the world's total land mass. For comparison, the following biggest country is Canada at 3,855,101 square miles. Russia is home to the coldest village in the world. Russia has harsh winter conditions, it is probably no surprise that Russia is home to the coldest village in the world. Winters in Oymyakon, Russia average minus 58 degrees Fahrenheit. The coldest recorded temperature in Oymyakon is minus 96 degrees Fahrenheit. Living in these harsh temperatures comes with its fair share of disadvantages. For example, if someone tries to wear glasses outside, the glasses will freeze on their face. Also, cars have to stay in heated garages or they will not start. Russia sold Alaska for $7.2 million. In 1897, Russia sold Alaska to the United States for only $7.2 million. With inflation, that is around $120 million today. At the time, Russia needed the money, and there weren't many Russian settlers living in Alaska. In addition to requiring the money, Russia believed that selling the land to the United States would help offset Europe's power. Russia has a lot of fresh water. Lake Baikal has more water than any other lake on Earth. Located in Siberia, Lake Baikal is the largest freshwater lake in the world by water volume. It contains 23% of the world's freshwater and has more water than all of the Great Lakes in North America combined. Not only is the lake the deepest lake in the world. Being in this chilly part of Russia, the lake regularly freezes during the winter, so it's even possible to drive across it. 